The sweater is an add-on for the West crochet pattern. So you should first watch the West pattern and crochet the West and then we'll continue crocheting the sleeves. For this tutorial we use also Charles Maya Select Belizea. This is color 235 and 2. And we use a 7 size crochet hook 4.5 millimeters. So I will show you how to crochet the sleeves. And we will start at this corner and the right side should face us. I will first attach the yarn. This is a simple knot, nothing special. Then I'm going, I'm going through the same stitch and I pull up a loop and then I chain one and I crochet only single crochets across the row and we will crochet in rows Use both loops for the first row, it's better for the sleeve. Yeah, and then we'll meet again at the beginning of the row. So this is the first row and now we have to join. Use a slip stitch, then chain one and turn your work. You can also work in spiral rounds. I will work this in joining rounds. And then we start with a decrease. So from the second row I will go only through the front loop to have my pattern again. I will first decrease and then I will continue with single crochets till the end of the row. And I will join here again and chain one, turn my work and continue in single crochet in single crochets and I will alternate between a row with a decrease and a row without a decrease. And it will look like this. So you will get this curve, so you have always a row with decrease, row without decrease and so on. And if your sleeve is thick enough, then you can stop decreasing and continue crocheting single crochets in rows without decreasing. And then we'll meet again at this point. My sleeve is now long enough. And at this point, if you want to continue, your outside, your right side of your work should face you. And we will start with a wrong double crochet. And then continue crocheting double crochets for the whole row. And we will decrease after five stitches. So after five double crochets. So this is the fourth, fifth, and now the decrease. Then we count again one, two, and so on. And after each fifth stitch, the decrease, and then then we will meet again at the end of the row. Now we will join the row. And this is a slip stitch. And we'll start again with a wrong double crochet. And then a front post double crochet. Then again. 
again. A double crochet. And a front post double crochet. And don't forget to decrease also in this row. So we have one, two, three, four, then five. And after five stitches we have a decrease. So these two counts, these two count as one. Because this was a decrease, you can see we have here only one stitch, so we have to front post under these three. Okay, and then we count again. One, two, three, four, and five, and then the decrease again under two yeah, and we alternate all the time between a double crochet and a front post double crochet and after this round we will continue without decreasing so you will have always one double crochet and one front post double crochet and we will continue doing this until the sleeve is long enough so your second sleeve should look like this yeah and then don't forget to sew your ends so you have to sew all of these ends and then you're done hope this tutorial was helpful and until next time Bye-bye.